boys, because a miracle drink is coming out. A miracle drink? It's a miracle drink. It's called Safety Shot. They say that this fucking can of whatever the shit is will cut your blood alcohol in level, uh, level in half in 30 minutes. Like 30 minutes, you drink a third, your blood levels. So it's promoting drinking and driving. Nice. Basically, I'm just saying, can you imagine if Lay hit this? If he got all banged up, he would drink a couple of these things, sober up, get drunk again. And I mean, it's a perfect thing for alcohol. Does it sober? Yeah. Yeah. So it gets rid of your blood, your, the alcohol in your blood by half, cuts it in half. So instead of these commercials, say, don't drink and drive. So if you're going to drive, take one of these. Take one of these safety shots. No, boys. Not that it's, I agree with, you know. It's not for that. It's. It's so you, you get, don't wake up feeling like shit. Or you, you get too fucking drunk. Or if you get pulled over, you say, yeah, I'll do no, it. You, you just got to wait 30 minutes. Yeah, that's the thing. You hold off the cause for 30 minutes. That's all you got to do. Yeah. Take me to the station, I'll do it. You Unless your blood alcohol level is like 4.0, and then this cuts it down to 2, but you're, you're still way a, over. Take a couple of them. Take like four of them. I don't know, man. I, I, I mean, I don't need it. It'd be it. good to have one in your pocket. You should have one in your pocket. Why? Because your blood alcohol level's pinned. No, it, it's not pinned. It Fuck stays consistent, pinned. man. It's Consistently pinned, that's what I mean. No, but I'm still, like... It's pinned. I'm still able to do shit. This is for people that are really fucked up. Right? Hmm. That have a serious drinking problem. I don't know. I don't you know. You don't think actually... you fall into that category? No. Fuck it, it probably tastes like shit. Fuck those guys. Julian, you drink alcohol from the minute your eyes open. Until the minute they close. Here's another fucking day. liquor story. And I don't like gin, thank fuck. Gin can suck it. This Australian gin place, they infuse the gin with green ants and it gives it a citrusy like flavor. Ooh. Green ants? Green ants. This is Australia. They got these ants that they eat. I, I, I want to see a green ant. Didn't okay. know there was such a thing. Green ants, man. They're green. Green ants and ham. But they Love eat it. It's a good source of protein. I mean. Mm. I didn't know people in Australia were eating insects like they do over in Asia. Oh, yeah, man. They are, man. Oh, they live in the outback and eat. They're eating bugs. Tons of Everybody bugs, eats man. bugs down there. I'm just looking at people who got born to them around the tent. Roy, the guy from Jaws? Roy Scheider. He was Brody, I guess? Yeah. <laughs> His fucking name doesn't have an N in it. That's it's Scheider, not Schneider. Point. Correct. I thought he was a Schneider. No. You're thinking, thinking of Duke Boys. No, no. Yeah, that's. Tom Schneider. And the fucking hot dogs. And you're, you know who you're thinking of? The fucking, the maintenance man on one day at a time. Am I? That was Schneider. Okay. Remember him? Yeah, and then you know what? There's Shopsy. What are hot, what's your hot dogs? Okay, just say. Russell Johnson, Gladiator. You were talking about him earlier. Russell oh, Johnson? Russell, Russell Crowe, man. Oh, yeah. Who's Russell Johnson? Oh, he was the professor on Gilligan's Island. Fuck. Oh, the professor. I love that show. Remember Gilligan's Island? There's a bunch of green ants, Rick. Are they green? Or they're brown? green. They like get a little brown, but they're they're little sacks on the back. What are they called? The thorax or whatever the fuck it is. Green. The thorax is a good movie. Yeah, it was awesome. Cut down all the trees. Oh man. The guy with Look the big mustache. Look at it. It looks like weed. You crumble oh, yeah. little fuckers up. They're fucking cool. You could probably smoke those things. Who gives a fuck? I'm just, I've never seen green ants before, man, that are tasty. Sinbad, Julian, he got born on November the 10th. Wasn't he one of your guys? What do you mean, what do you mean one of my guys? He was one of the 10 jacks. those guys that make you giggle. He was one of the fucking top oh, 10 man. jack kings. Jack kings? Yeah. What do you mean jack kings? <laughs> top 10 jack, the guys you would jack to. Oh, jack material. Yeah. No, man. DJ Major Major Laser. Got born. DJ like, Major Laser. He's good. I like him. Yeah. I don't even know who the fuck. Who the fuck is D are. DJ Major Laser? Taron e Egerton from Rocket Man. Yes. The actor said he's that? good, wasn't he? He played Elton John in Rocket Man. He's fucking fantastic. Right. Yeah, he kind of looked like Happy you. Happy birthday, you fuckers. Happy birthday. Everybody. We should watch uh, Jaws. And I'll watch should... Jaws, Roy Scheider. Then we can watch the uh, triple X version of Jaws. What's that called? Jaws. Called Jaws what? Triple X? What the fuck's going the porno on? Porno Jaws? <laughs> what happens in that? <laughs> I don't know. Things are in 
healed. Is there is it shark porn? No. Jaws. Is there a Roy Scheider character who gets his freak on? Is there there is. Is there a chick with big teeth? She's got a big jaw. (laughs) (laughs) She's got a big big jawed woman who's in Jaws. I couldn't see that. I'm oh, there was also Jaws that was in it. Moonraker. Remember Jaws? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Scary fucker. He's dead, isn't he? He is dead. Yeah, he was... Ingrown hard on he died from. An ingrown hard on Yeah. I had to kill him. Went. It was too big. All the blood the went to way. him? No, it went in and poked a hole in something, and then he bled out. Yeah. That's unlucky. Big metal teeth on him. Remember him? Scary, but remember he could bite through fucking cable car wire? You were terrified of that guy, man. I was. Walton Goggins from uh, Vice Principals also got born today. Oh, yes. Don't know. I don't know if I do. I should know him. I love that show. Walter Goggins? He was in the eighth lead as well. I now need to see a picture. Pull up a picture of Walton. Walter Goggins. Is he the guy, the second guy, like, that's also in... Righteous James. That's what I'm wondering, because if it is, he's I think it is. Crazy. That's Walter Goggins, I, I think. Goggins? Baby Billy. G-O, just how it's G-O-G-G-I-N-S. Oh, I right, think here we it's go, here Baby Billy, isn't it? I hope so. Oh, that dude. I think he was in the show Justified, too. He was. Watch that in prison. And The Shield. Okay, what about him? I got a picture. I want to see a fucking picture of him. Why? Because I can't think of who he is. Some stupid. You know who the fuck he is. Yeah, that's baby. No, it's not baby Billy, is it? I can't tell. I can't tell. It's a shitty picture. No, it's not. You know why? He looks like one of those, one of the Dylan boys. That's what he looks like. <laughs> you know Matt Dillon on the spider? Oh, I know. Some fucking the yeah, Dylan fellas. I haven't memorized every inch of his features. You know who like, this uh, fucking guy is, man. That guy. It's not what I was Pass it over so I can have a better look at him. Don't fucking wreck my fireplace. Yeah, that's baby Billy. It is, okay. So we were right. Yeah. Love that guy. Yeah, she's fucking very good. Very good. Thing away from yeah. Yeah. Don't be throwing around a $50 fucking fireplace. All right. Jesus Christ. Broid rage. Lava. Yeah, right, Bloods. What if has a heat setting? It doesn't, Ricky. Well, how the fuck is it no going to make heat? Method. Make it down here in the fan would blow it up. It would be um, dangerous if that had a heating element. I in like it. danger. I also like heat. Here you go, Ricky. This is something you've been talking about doing this for a long time. This guy did it. Man lives unnoticed under shopping mall share staircase for half a year. Mm. Six months. I don't know. Is that better than going to shopping jail? Shopping mall staircase? You'd have some time at fucking night when it was closed. I spent quite a few nights at Knickknack Mall when I was younger. I'd love to live at the mall. Me too, man. I slept in Woody the Christmas tree. Nobody looked there. How many times you piss on him? Piss on him? Yeah, you pissed on Woody, didn't you? You were were bragging about it. I threw a bunch of shit at him. I don't think I ever pissed on him. I'd like to live at the mall in Santa's I did piss off him once from the third floor. Yeah, that's what I thought. Got kicked out. Yeah, remember? And it shorted out one of his eyes. And then one eye was moving. And the other one was piss shorted. Wow. See, this is why I don't want to get married, boys. This good-looking married woman stages fake weddings to marry three other men for money. It's easy to get sucked in, boys. All women are going to probably... You got to do your due diligence before you get married. Yeah, but the thing is... You don't just marry somebody in two minutes. You know how easy it is for a woman... What if you did the reverse? I'd marry three women for money. Sounds like something you might do. I would do that if it wasn't so greasy. Nah, I'd do it. Fuck would it. You, would like, you marry an older woman? Lot, yeah. Had a lot of money? 100%. How old? How old would you go? 100? I'd say, no, man. Jesus, Bob. 65. 70's my cutoff. Wow. Okay. 70's? <laughs> I'm telling you. But you wouldn't marry a 100-year-old lady that was a billionaire. It's fucking right, so I would. Okay, we've just... I would fall on. madly in love with her. Because she she's probably not going to be around long either. Well, then would you have intimacy? If she's... <laughs> yeah, how about this, honey? Gently. Your fella here wants a 1967 Camaro. And if I get that, I'm going to be very happy and horny. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get it going, baby. Yeah, I'm sure, yeah. I'm sure we could work something out. All right. 
good to know. Get See, older, I learn new things about you. You man. greasy bastard. What the? Come on. Marrying an old lady for her money. <sighs> Someone's going to use it. She's going to be dead. Who's she going to give it to her kids? Fuck that. Well, the kids probably didn't deserve it if they're not already rich. Not as much as you did. I mean, who, an older de- woman. who deserves it more than you? Swooping in in the last fucking four hours of her life. <laughs> yeah, it does sound kind of greasy, doesn't it? You know what? Those would... kids don't deserve it. Looking after her for eighty years. I would look after her. <laughs> I would give her everything she wanted, man. Like the male version of that. Who was that female that did that? Or super old dude? She's dead now. Nicole. Yes. Yeah. Nicole Kidman. Ah, she did, but she got jack shit from Buddy. It wasn't Nicole Kidman. No, that was that's a different one, man. She was... Anna Nicole Smith. Oh yeah, Nicole there Smith. You go. Thank you. Nicole Kidman was was <laughs> trapped by Tom Cruise. For trapped. Years. Yeah. She was. Oh, I know. Wow. Well. Well, let's go down and. Let's I'll get... make more of these, and we'll go down and sell them and give the money to the veterans. All right, we're going to go to the liquor store. That's the best place to do it. We just got to make sure. Oh, our... the guy selling them there put the fucking run, put the boots to me. Well, we're going to make sure he put the disappears for the afternoon. Then. We're going to stop by Jim's Firehouse and have a little talk. Is I'm it local? Go, uh... Why would you order it? If no, it was it's low? not. It's about a four-hour drive. We're not tra- We're not going four hours to bring this back. No. It's fucking fifty. We'll send I feel it like back. I feel like it got ripped off. You know what? Bring that with us. We'll try to sell it when we're selling the poppies. We'll give it to a veteran. All right. Yeah. Warm them up. The guy that's they're selling will say, "Hey, buddy, take this. Beat it for about we'll two take, hours. We'll take that can of change." That's right. All right, let's do it. All right, happy remembrance day, everybody. It's uh, not a happy. It's not like uh, whatever the fuck it's you not say. Happy. Let's we forget. Let's not. No, whatever. Remembrance Day. Cheers. Cheers. Uh, November 11. Cheers, man. It's rude. It's them. <laughs>